In this tutorial, we will learn how to create a 3D pipe like this, quickly. Let us first delete everything here. Now, add a curve from the Add menu. You can add a Bezier curve or simply take a path. While the path or the curve is selected, go to the Edit mode. Then click on any one end. We need to extrude it. So press E on your keyboard, move your mouse to some distance, and left-click once. Again press E and repeat the process to design a pipe. Don't worry about the exact shape, you can fine-tune it later. Once this is done, go back to the object mode. The basic design of our pipe is ready. We need to add a thickness to it. So, add a bezier circle. To reduce its size, press S on your keyboard, then 0.15, and then enter. You can also change it later from this properties editor. Now select this curve and go to the curve tab. You will see a section called geometry. Under this, there is a bevel section. Switch over to the object tab and in the target object, select the bezier circle we have added. Our pipe is now ready. You can also add a material for this. And select any color you like. You will often need to make some changes into the shape of the pipe. So you can go back to the edit mode and make necessary changes in the curve. For example, you can extrude it further. Or you can also modify the location of the existing points. If you are not very familiar with curve editing, I made another tutorial just on this subject. The link is in the video description. So, once the editing is done to your satisfaction, go back to the object mode. You can now convert this into a mesh. For that, go to the object menu and select Convert to Mesh. The Bezier circle is no longer needed, so you can delete it now. Remember, once you convert the pipe into a mesh, you cannot modify its shape anymore. So do all your fine-tuning before you convert it. That's all for today. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to this channel.